The current US copyright system is broken. Copyright is supposed to protect creators' rights to their work and foster innovation. But instead, it makes creative monopolies like Disney, Spotify, News Corp, and Amazon richer at the expense of artists. During the pandemic, restrictive licensing schemes allowed monopolists to rip off public schools with exorbitant ebook prices and limit the number of creative voices available to young readers. When live events were on pause, smaller electronic musicians tried to emulate Instagram sponsored acts by making a living using the platform as a digital venue. But because big corporations couldn't profit from their streams, they were hit with strict copyright based punishment and shut out. When rights are reserved for only the biggest players, who perpetuate an exploitive system, art becomes less diverse and innovative. It hurts everyone, not just creators, when creative monopolies decide which artists are successful and champion the tools of censorship. More and more, the tools of oppression used by creative monopolies are used to undermine social change and basic human rights. Life-saving COVID-19 technology is being withheld from billions because of false claims that sharing vaccines and ventilators would harm creators, a lie being told to help Big Pharma. Meanwhile, police officers are weaponizing the DMCA to censor activists who record video for police accountability. Copyright is incompatible with modern society and broken for all of us because it's rigged for monopolies and giant investment funds. As artists, we're fighting for change to take our power back. Take action at endcreativemonopolies.com.